Uh, Wollaston is a is a fantastic tennis club. It's a very much a social based tennis club. Um, we're based uh, just outside of the town of Stourbridge. Um, technically, we're in the South Staffs uh, area rather than the West Midlands, so we yeah. have to hop over the, the <laughs> county line. Um, but we we are we're a club that's very much driven around kind of all inclusive tennis. We have absolutely fantastic uh, facilities. We've got eight great courts. Um, two of which are, well they're all floodlit, but two of which are, are now uh, synthetic clay, which is mm. where uh, you know, the LTA wants most of the tennis clubs to take their courts mm -hmm. because it, it, it promotes you know, a better style of play and it's, it's much, much better for the, the youngsters to be able to learn to play on. Mm -hmm. Great for top spin. It's really trying to mimic what's happening in Spain in the clay court okay. environment. Um, We've been, uh, we've been in existence about 65 years, but we've actually been at our current address at Presswood Drive for 50 years, oh, and it's our, it's our 50 year anniversary. Uh -huh. Congratulations. Um, thank you very much, thank you very much. So it's a big year for us. Yeah. Um, local people who, who've been in the tennis scene over, over the years who will know the club will mm -hmm. know that we, we pretty much have, a very, or used to have, a very, very rough track going <laughs> down because we're, we're kind of hidden away in the countryside. I see. Um, and that's all, you know, we've recently had all the road done and, and we're, we're really hoping now that's going to help push the club on. Yeah. You know, it's, it's a club with a great reputation. Mm -hmm. um, as I say, we, we, uh, we play a lot of uh, league tennis as well, so we play in the South Staffs League. And, uh, and that means we get people coming to the club all the time from all over, all over the place. And it's, it's, but it's a very friendly, open, social club, um, great for kids, great for families, uh, great for you know, those ageing players like me who want to get back into the <laughs> sport. So a really good place to play tennis. Fantastic. And sometimes tennis has uh, perhaps a bit of an elite, um, you know, people have a preconception that perhaps it's, it's quite expensive or it's not open to all. Yeah. Um, what, what do you think? Uh, it, it definitely still has that image. You know, mm. there's, there's no doubt about that kind of almost middle class tag that, that comes with tennis. Mm -hmm. But the reality is tennis isn't like that. At the grassroots level, there are, there are hundreds of clubs, thousands mm. of clubs all across the country. Uh, you know, and the, the entry level into tennis really is, is, is find a, a, a court, find a club that fits you. you know. The cost of playing tennis is, is pretty low in, when you compare it to things like going to the gym and, and, mm. and other kinds of sports. You know, I mean, we, you know, as an adult, we uh, at Wollaston we pay uh, about you know just just shy over two hundred pounds a year. That's okay. pretty cheap yeah. compared to gym membership. Yeah. You know, and kids can get involved from from really really low rates. You know, juniors, under 11s, for you know sub forty quid a year mm -hmm. uh, to to be a member of the club. It's about getting kids in as early as we can. We all know that in sport, that the more people we get playing tennis, the more chance we're going to produce Andy Murray's yeah. successor. And that's what we want. You know, yeah, we, fingers crossed. We complained about the fact that we didn't have one yeah. for 75 years. Yeah. Now we've got to find the next one. So, mm -hmm. But yeah, it, it has that elitist tag. But when you play in the, in, in, in the kind of these local club environments, mm -hmm. it's about fun. You know, it's a very, very social sport. It's a very social game.